So the other day I posted about life purpose and how I don't really have a life purpose. What's really important for me is that I'm living day to day what I love. I had other people write in that absolutely thrive on life purpose and are very connected to a very specific life purpose. And I love that kind of feedback. Um, so today I wanna kind of relate all of that back to the notion of goal setting. I have friends and clients who love to set goals. They love to achieve goals. They like to have something out there that they're working towards and they love to check that off. And I think that that's great. I don't work that way, okay? I, I'll never forget, I had an ex-boyfriend's father ask me several years ago, so, so Patsy, what's your five-year plan? And I was like, deer in the headlights. I have <laughs> no idea. I just follow the energy. I just go with where life is taking me. Um, but I love intentions. So right now, my intention is to um, write and publish a book, right? So I'm taking all the steps towards that. But I'm also enjoying every minute along the way of the creative process, of the writing process, of this communication process, and meeting people, interacting with people. And I trust that energy to take me much further than me setting something out there where I think I'm going. I never want to be too fixed in, in that final thing. I like to stay open along the way to actually where the, where the energy is actually taking me. And I look at other instances, whether it was my yoga teacher training or my coach um, training, and how I've never quote unquote become necessarily those things, a yoga teacher or a coach, but those classes have and and those what I learned are very much instrumental in how I'm writing and how I'm communicating today um, it wasn't an end point and there is no end point to me it's just so much more about the journey the energy of the journey and trusting that it's going to take me exactly where I'm wanting to go